This time for the capacitor bank we have a small fluorescent lamp tube starter for a single 20 watt fluorescent lamp. The problem with the starter is it's annoyed me. It's no longer starting my lamps. So maybe the 130 volts that's marked on it simply isn't enough. Let's dump 6,000 volts into it from a 62 microfarad capacitor bank and see what, if any, result we can get from this broken, useless fluorescent lamp starter. Well, let's get ready, charge up, and fire our fluorescent lamp starter. Bank charging, bank charged, and fire! Well, something happened. Let's see if we can find out what happened. Are there enough bits and pieces left? Well, I could only find some of the bits after a quick search of the workbench and the surrounding floor. We got back a tiny bit of the glass from the little glass bulb inside these starters, as well as the uh, electrodes that were inside the glass bulb. A bit of the outer plastic casing can be seen, and the base with its two connector legs survived. There's also a small capacitor in these units. It has utterly, completely vanished. Well, I would say that this fluorescent starter is not going to give me any more trouble or grief.